Hello YouTube friends, welcome to Maria's Miscellany, where in today's video I'm going to share with you um, how I played with some of my new supplies. Uh, if you watched a haul that I did a few days ago, um, I showed you that I picked up this, um, I don't know which one it was now because I actually went back and got a couple of more. I think it was this one, color box. Um, Petal Point Pigment Inks, and I found this at the Salvation Army for $2.99. However, I went on a Wednesday, and Wednesdays they have everything half off, so I paid $1.49 for this. And I only bought one. Um, I got excited about some other stuff there, and I had a limited amount of money, so I picked up only one. And then somebody commented, you know, oh, you should get more because, you know, those are really expensive. They're like 20 bucks or so for them and um, I decided to go back and I picked up these two more now there were others there but they weren't some of them you know I kind of felt felt them and some of them felt really dry and I don't know about you know how you would go about uh, you know wetting them and stuff so I just picked these up but I was able to get all three of these for about f less than five dollars so that is amazing so I wanted to play around with the colors and see, you know, how well they worked and everything. So let me show you what I did. Um, I'll, I'll talk to you about this in a minute, but let me put it back here. Okay. So what I did is I had a strip, just a little strip of cardstock. I already cut these up, but I had a little strip of cardstock left over from something else that I cut up or, or whatever. And I went through each one of these and I just cut um printed um, using my stamps from um, Tuesday morning. I'm going to be using these in a project for a retreat, a ladies retreat that we're doing at my church. I'm going to be making, making the little um, notebooks that the ladies will uh, get in their, um, in their gift bag so that they can take notes and stuff. And so I picked these up and I wanted to try them out. And I figured, okay, I'll try out the stamps and I'll try out the inks. So this is what I came up with. Now, I don't know how well the colors are coming up, but this is kind of like a brown color. This is uh, kind of like a brick, a brick red color. This is a nice peachy pink. And I believe those are from this box right here the ones that I'm looking at yep this one is a, a, that color right there no this one is that color this one is a, that color so this one here was that one this one was th that one I believe this one was another box I think this one was this gold and I did have, yeah, this one you can hardly see. Um, I'm thinking this probably would be better on a dark uh, card sock, but it was that one. Okay, so did I show you all of those? No, I think this one here was that one. That was the first one. And then this one, nope, this one was this. So, is that all eight of them? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, okay, so that was that box. Cool. Then I went on, sorry about my arm, to, which one did I go to next? This box right here. Did I? No, this box. Okay, so in this box, I tried that one. That's that color over there. I don't know, do you want me to come closer? Maybe I should come closer. Yeah, there's that color. Then there's this color. Then there is this color. Oops. And they're a tiny bit shimmery, not very much, but it's pretty cool. Then there is this color, and this is like a brownish. I really like that, actually, for a neutral color. I mean, I really like it. Okay, then this one down here is that color. Then um, 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 uh, this one was this color up here. 
and here's that color again then these two uh, I, ha I don't think I did the yellow one at all but see that what happens is these two are stuck in there and I haven't wanted to force them out see how they're supposed to come out like that uh, all of them come out like that except these two are really stuck and I've tried grabbing them with um what do you call it you know a tool one of these um i'll have it around here right now oh, i can't think of the name not a wrench uh pliers pliers i tried using pliers to help me pull them but i i wasn't able to do it i tried kind of pushing it from the back here i wasn't able to then they're really jammed in there so the way i i had to do or the way i used the blue to stamp this is I took out this one and this one well not actually really just that one because I can't take this one out and I put my stamp around it like that and so so far that is how um, I guess I'm gonna need to use it because if I just put it right there it's kind of hard to get the whole stamp in there you know so anyway that's the blue one and this one I believe nope that's it I didn't do the yellow one on this one then oh, once again sorry about my arm there then this one i really like the more earth tony colors uh let's see i started with this one right here i believe yep then this is that that one my oh gosh i'm getting off the camera so this was this this was this this one was here that one that one was there and where did I do the others? Did I finish these? I think I messed with these up here. That is that one, I believe. Hmm, I might have to redo no, redo these last couple. I don't know. I'm going to have to like maybe label them and make myself a sampler. Um, I just kind of grabbed and started playing. And, um, <laughs> you know, didn't really keep track of much. Got too excited. I just wanted to try them all out. Okay. So, so there's that, the color box. I'm really happy about that deal. I'm going to have a lot of fun. I've never been much of a stamper. Um, I really have to practice using my stamps because look, see, I get, uh, you have to have a very, very steady hand, I guess, and stuff. Um, so another thing that I tried is, you see this right here? I did that using, oh gosh, I thought I had it right here to show you. Yes using this piece of corrugated cardboard now I wish I could remember who um, mentioned this or had this idea that I I know it was somebody on YouTube that had the idea and I thought oh that's a great idea um, but uh, I basically you see how it's ridged like that I took um, the ink and I just put it on here and then I just tapped it now I just did it to half of it because thought that was a good size for like journaling journaling card so what I'm going to do is I'm going to like all of these that are nice that that worked out okay I mean that one's kind of messed up right here and that one's messed up but some of the others I'm going to try to cut out and use in something <laughs> um, now these uh, I was playing with the Dollar Tree stamps that um, I got a while back I've never really played much with them but it was this one and it says life with you is good and it's got this butterfly and these flowers so I just tried a little bit of that with the different stamps see there's the blue again I really like these two colors so but yeah I was really excited to do this so I went ahead and did it again here and I really like this one this again I used the ombre or ombre <laughs> effect with this I just um, did uh, you know put this here left it a little while took it off and then put it down so um, you can see the, the, the color variations and is there glitter on this it looks kind of glittery does this have glitter on it hmm no I must have gotten some glitter from somewhere because you know if you get glitter anywhere it goes everywhere so there's that. 
I played with a little bit with that. This one got really smudged, but I think I can still use it for something. And then these are these stamps again that I was just playing with. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with them, if I'm going to try, I guess, coloring them in or what have you to use. But right now, it's just playing. So that is all I'm going to share with you for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't already and you like this kind of video, please subscribe. Um, I have a couple of more things I want to share with you that I'm going to be working on. Oh, as well as a little Michael's haul that um, of stuff that I picked up. Actually, I returned an item and I picked up a few others. So um, I'll show you, probably, probably show you that next. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this video once again. And uh, most of all, I hope you have a blessed day. Thank you so much for stopping by.